Simplify n squared r to the fifth n to the negative seventh. Express your answer in exponential form with positive exponents. Let me just rewrite what they have up there. So we have n squared r to the fifth n to the negative seven. So the easiest way to simplify this, I would say kind of just while we are multiplying them, group the common bases. So we have two, we have two exponent expressions with n as a base. We have n squared, and we have n to the negative 7. So let me just rearrange this multiplication right here. I could rewrite this as n squared, n to the negative 7. And then we have our r to the fifth, r to the fifth. And what's this going to be equal to? Well, we have n squared times n to the negative 7. We can add those two exponents. So this right here would simplify to n to the 2 minus 7. 2 minus 7 is negative 5. n to the negative 5, r to the fifth. Now, we've simplified this about as much as we can, but we're not done yet. Because they said express your answer in exponential form with positive, with positive exponents. This is a negative exponent here. This is not acceptable, at least based on what they asked us to do. So we know that n to the negative fifth, n to the negative fifth is the same thing as 1 over n to the fifth. So we can just rewrite it this, that way. So this is the same thing. That right there is 1 over n to the fifth times r to the fifth. Or we could say this is equal to r to the fifth over, over, over n to the fifth. And this is about as simple as you can get. If you wanted to do other things here, you could say that this is equal to r over n to the fifth, since both of these are being raised to the fifth power. But this is probably what they want here. This is we've simplified it and all of the exponents are now positive because we put the we put the n in the denominator.